Welcome back to CBS News Detroit. What better way to welcome the first day of fall than with Canterbury Village's Michigan Fall Fest. We are so excited. The festival kicks off tomorrow and joining to tell us about it is Canterbury's owner, Keith Aldridge. Good morning. You Good morning. really brought a fun spread because we not only have things here, we've got things at the other desk yeah, and we'll show that too. It's, it's arts and crafts hour here today at, uh, at CBS, which is kind of exciting, but uh, Lots of fun this weekend at Canterbury Village. We have about 35 uh, great Michigan small business vendors that are gonna be here. Obviously, uh, Yates Cider Mill is gonna be on site with delicious donuts and cider. And then obviously we have all kinds of fun activities. We brought pumpkins today to paint. Um, you know, I'm kind of the Martha Stewart now of, uh, of, of Canterbury Village. So lots of fun stuff to do for the kids. Monster truck rides, hay bales, Pumpkin bowling, which is everybody's favorite. Oh, oh wow, uh, that sounds like a lot yeah, of fun. Yeah, magicians, live music. It's going to be a great weekend, and the weather looks like it's going to be in our favor this year. Don't yeah. you get nervous for that? <laughs> uh, every weekend. I'm sure. Kylie's the meteorologist yeah. here. Yeah, so it's going she, to be yeah. fantastic this weekend. So yes. definitely go out, and you can actually paint your own pumpkin. And the folks at the desk over there, Chris, Sandra, and Terrence, also have pumpkins as well. You guys are decorating those. We want to thank you guys for bringing these pumpkins in, and we're going to continue to color them. But tell us a little bit more about the event. So is there, a, I think I read that there's like a petting zoo that's going to be there. What else, what kind of activities? Yep. Correct. Uh, lots of stuff for kids. Uh, petting zoo, we have a pumpkin patch where uh, uh, parents and, and kids can pick out their favorite pumpkin for the holidays. Obviously, it's a little early to start carving now, so that's why we are, are doing the pumpkin painting, so you can get a little bit more life out of your pumpkin. Um, hay mail, or hay pyramid, which I don't know, kids love it. Bounce houses. What is a hay pyramid? Just hay you pyramid. have bales stacked ba and they climb? And they climb. And oh they my goodness. And absolutely have, have a great time. Um, for Hall our big Halloween stroll is coming up and we already have uh, the minion part of the oh, stroll. Oh, fun. So uh, lots of minions to get great selfies with out there. And uh, it's just a great setting for Canterbury Village. It's a lot of fun to you know decompress on Saturdays and Sundays after our crazy week and uh, it's going to be a good time. Mm -hmm. And I can definitely smell these uh, donuts over here. So, Rochelle, I'm going to dig into one while you so continue good. to paint our okay. colorful yeah, bats. I'm really carrying the pumpkin over here, Kylie. She <laughs> did one bat and then ditched me. I did one me. bat. I'm like, okay, I'm smelling the donuts <laughs> <laughs> this hour. But as you said, like pretty much every weekend going forward, if some if people can't go out this weekend to the mm -hmm. Fall Fest, there's other weekends. Yep. So in two, and then obviously we have a weekend off where it's just, you know, donuts and cider and, you know, fun bounce houses and play stuff and then uh, then we start our uh, Halloween mm. stroll which is kind of uh, famous in Metro Detroit we started it in 2019 and it's really turned into one of the best Halloween strolls in in all of Metro Detroit as I said uh, 50 actors we have out there great now, is it prop scary is it too scary for the little kids no 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 it's very family friendly okay. um, we have a you know a lot of family friendly things we do there are a couple spots where it is a little scary uh, mm -hmm. but not not too much and i'm a big family man so no it's all about the kids <laughs> why do you think canterbury village is so just iconic for southeast michigan i mean beyond the halloween you know spooky stuff and fun family activities you always hear people talking about it it's such a gem here what thank you i way? appreciate that i think the um, architecture what my late father built uh you know the property is so unique it's not something you see every day uh, it's just not four walls and an asphalt roof the architecture is beautiful and then you know we've incorporated all the family fun <laughs> events and as i said earlier in the segment our weeks are crazy now uh, yeah. you're, mm -hmm. you're right in that with uh, with the little guy at home. Yes, yes. <laughs> and uh, our weeks are so crazy, so it's really nice for families to come out on Saturday and Sunday and Sundays and just decompress. They're all there for a couple hours together. It's safe, it's fun, and it's relaxing. And right. I, don't, I don't know, do you have um, your baby's Halloween costume yet? Oh, yes. We do themed family costumes okay. every year. So then maybe you could go there in your costumes then, this right? I'm sure a lot of Will people you will allow out. some Disney villains? Because this year we've got <laughs> 10 of us. We're all different Disney villains. Oh, are you? Oh, okay. that's fun. Awesome. Mm -hmm. yeah. Please don't tell me you're the Queen of Hearts. I am not. Okay. I am not. I won't give away more than that. So this isn't, you know, super. Oh, my goodness. This is a heavy pumpkin. Oh, that's unbelievable. This is deceivingly oh, heavy. Yes. Uh, not our best work. I'm hoping Sandra, Terrence, and Chris did a little bit better but <laughs> as we show our pumpkins can you tell us ticket prices where people can buy tickets yep. hours that good stuff yep. oh my three dollars <laughs> online three dollars online uh, kids and under or kids 12 and under are free but you can find everything on canterburyvillage.com 
Facebook has the, the list of events, uh, schedule times for everything. And yes, I picked that up this morning as like a cinder block. It's, it's very <laughs> deceiving. Like I, I work out, I promise. All right, Sandra, Terrence, Chris, can you show us show us your progress? The over big there? reveal. Turn them around. Me too. Oh. Lift it up. Oh, oh Sandra. Those look so good. I like Chris's ghosts. Yeah, Purple look and at white that. ghosts on we there. Look at that. We so got spooky. three traditional ghosts and then one that went funky with the purple. Uh, <laughs> there, yeah. Those look great. These are so much fun. Those look fabulous. All right, make sure you get to Canterbury Village this fall season. Keith, thank you so much for being on with us. Yeah, we really appreciate you. it. And you made this a lot of fun.